what's the impact of winning an Oscar for the best music for a motion picture? Wow, I mean, overnight, everything changed. But I think for me, a lot of it was the reward of working on a film like Soul. It's such an amazing thing. It ties together everything, as you can see now from this show tonight, it ties together everything that I really am all about. The big existential questions about the soul and our purpose in life and where we come from, jazz and music and all of the, the great things that we got to do in that score, to see it at the time in the world that it came out in, at the end of 2020, after we had been through so much, to have it reach so many people and give them some light and for that to be the thing that we're awarded so heavily for, I mean, it, it's, it's, it's so transcendent and I'm so humbled by it. And it's such a beautiful film, everything about it. Oh, thank you so much. I, I am, um, I'm honored to have been able to work on, we were a family for two years working on that film. And uh, I still keep in touch with everybody and we look forward to, just seeing how over the years, you know, Pixar and, and their films are like mythology for kids. So over the years to see what the legacy of the film will be, will be quite um, an amazing thing. And a, and a short aside, uh, just a story after the Oscars, the day after I went to visit Herbie Hancock, who was the first black composer to win the Oscar for Best Original Score. And I'm the second, and he won the year that I was born. So there's all kinds of celestial, tie-in that I feel like it's so much bigger than us about that film. This is the first time I've actually prepared a speech. I never did this before. Maybe I have to pre prepare speeches in the future. <laughs> in, in accepting this award, I salute the same unsung heroes that you so boldly have chosen to applaud. Some are with us today and some are not. Many have suffered and even died for this music this greatest of all expression of the creative spirit of humankind, jazz. From their suffering and pain, we can learn that life is the subject, the story that, that music so eloquently speaks of. And it is not the other way around. We as individuals must develop our lives to the fullest to strengthen and deepen the story that others can be inspired by life's song. I thank Bertrand Tavernier, Erwin Winkler, Francis Poudre, Dexter Gordon, Chris Lanval, William Flagellet, and the cast and crew for their sincere efforts through love and respect for this American-born art form called jazz. Praise has long been overdue for Bud Powell, Lester Young, Thelonious Monk, Charlie Parker, Billie Holiday, and many, many others. Along with you, I thank them Along with them, I thank you. Thank you.